Hello everybody, it's me, Blokusatsu. <clears throat> Sorry. And today we are going to review the SA Figure Arts Common Rider Prime Rogue. Now, a little backstory before I get into this. This for, for people who want to know, wait, Prime Rogue? Wait, wait, when did this happen in build? Well Okay, so well so spoiler. If you don't want to get spoiled, I recommend not watching this video. But for people, but for people who already did watch the hyper, the hyper Bell special, you guys want to know when heck Gentro got the black jacket in a couple episodes after build. Well, sorry about that. Well, the hyper Bell special, common common writer build prime world hyper Bell DVD. Explain when Gentro got the black jacket, and also in that special, he got this form as well. And I want to say this just, just, just for those type of fans yes, the form is canon. Now, with that out of the way, let's go on talking about this figure because we got a lot to talk about. All right, first off. First off, to get this out of the way, here's the cape. M now, my copy have a little uh, smudges on there, sadly. You can't see, but now you can see. There's a little smudges on mine. <sighs> I'll go back to the cape later. But right now, oh, right now, the colors for this guy, so beautiful. I like the purple they did. I know that they, I know that they must, I know that they, what they did is they must, they upgraded from the, from the first release of Rogue and did this for him, which I love. I love the color. It's all beautiful. Prime Rogue's one of my favorite, uh, power up. Well, suit designs, you could say, because it's so clean. <laughs> Oops, sorry. <laughs> it is so clean. I don't gonna know where I got this guy. Well, I got this from I got this from Hobby Genki, <laughs> and I think that sold out right now. But I pre-ordered this from Hobby Genki when I had the chance, and <laughs> good thing I did because anything build related, y'all already know I'm going to get it. <laughs> So let's go on to like ab crunch. Well, you see, this is how far he goes. This is how far he goes back. Goes back due to the driver being in the way. This is not like his. Uh, his uh, this is not like his base form. Again, then I can't compare the two because I don't have his base form. I will get that one day in Greece. Well, I'm praying in Greece, so. <laughs> Hey, for that. So yeah, so let's go on to neck articulation. Now the neck artic oh, whew. now now the neck articulation is somewhat a little bit more non-limited than the last one, which is good. At the same time, way better than. Way better than first will because he had a neck articulation limited problem. Now I don't have the SHF upgrade peg. I will get that eventually. But if I have that now, Rogue's head would be spinning way more. So on to the belt. Well, not nothing new about the belt except for <laughs> just for the prime roll power right there. So yay. So See how far his arms can go. Don't like that, uh, <laughs> don't like that crack sound. Here's how far his arms can go. Let's do his legs. Ooh. Yep. You got, you gotta be careful. Oh, by the way, I wanna talk about this. You see these two gold pieces? Yeah, this one right here loves to fall off, so you gotta be careful of that one. It loves to come, it loves to fall, off, fell off, fall off the uh, <laughs> the figure. 
Oh man. I freaking, oh, <laughs> I freaking love the figure. The design of it is so clean. Design wise and color wise, it's, it's really clean, not gonna lie. Oh man, so good. So good, I'm so happy that I have this guy. I just need grease then to have the whole build boys. Also, you can do like a lot of poses with Rogue as well. I did a lot of poses with this guy, and man, he's, his articulation is so good. His articulation is so good. You just got to be careful with, with with his ab articulation because throughout the build driver, well, the build driver is in the way. So there's that as well. So be careful of that. So good. This guy looks so clean. Sorry. So on to <laughs> so on to size comparison. Just because this is rogue, let me go uh, get them. Here we have some other build SHF. We have my favorite villain, the baddie himself. This looks so beautiful right there, I'm not gonna lie. This looks so beautiful. I freaking love it. Let's move these bad boys out of the way. Oops. <laughs> Sorry, Bonjo. Sorry, Gento. Here he is with the Oh great. Goku. What what the heck? Sorry about that. Here he is with the SHF Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Here he is with the SHF Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. And just for this one, because right now, here he is with the SHF. Kamen Rider Vulcan. Shooting Wolf. Oops, sorry. Now I'll try again. Here it is. Oh! <laughs> He's doing pretty well with them. Well, not with... Well, somewhat with Vegeta, but okay. Here it is with some lightning collection in space red. And here it is with red Zeo. <laughs> yeah, if you feel like you want to get your uh, somewhat crossovers on, then yeah. One last thing, one last thing I want to talk about. I want to talk about this. He doesn't cover a lot, just like his uh, regular version. No steam gun, no steam blade. He does come with two open. So, oh crap! Sorry. He does come with two open hands. Two somewhat closer slash palm palmish hands. Come on, stop dropping. And. <laughs> And you get these, and you get these when you open the figure, his uh, fisted hands. But I, I prefer those hands on him, but hey, that's just me. Here are his fisted hands that he used to bang, uh, punch people. Yeah. So. That's Prime Rogue overall. This guy is a, this guy is a great alternative if you can't get like regular rogue. 
Why am I saying that? Well, if well, if you like me, that's trying to that's trying to complete the build boys. Then, then you ain't know that. Yeah, you need this guy. You need this guy for your collection. Look at this. This is beautiful. Hope you all like, pre like, comment, subscribe. All my social media will be in the description. My name, <laughs> Bokusatu. Ciao.